Legalization acceleration. Virginia's governor wants to make marijuana possession legal this year, three years earlier than planned. Northern Virginia Bureau reporter Drew Weiler takes us inside one of the Commonwealth's licensed medical marijuana operations that could be key for the future of recreational use. Inside this massive building in Manassas, the beginning of Virginia's marijuana market. We're doing our first harvest. We're excited about it. Rows and rows, stacks ceiling high. This is Northern Virginia's state licensed medical marijuana grow and dispensing operation. Really high quality cannabis. Eric Mauf is the president and founder of Jushi, the company that owns this facility and several others like it around the country. Showing us around his operation, he says this is how Virginia can weed out the illicit marijuana market. We're offering a safe, clean, well-priced alternative to what's coming through the unregulated market. State Senator Adam Eben says these medical operations are key to Virginia moving into commercial, recreational adult use. I think the fact that we have people doing that in Virginia now uh, who will be eligible for retail licenses and also to incubate uh, equity licensees will help share that expertise. Virginia's General Assembly passed a bill to make recreational marijuana legal for adults over 21 by 2024. But Governor Ralph Northam wants possession of up to one ounce legal this year. The reason? Decriminalization is not addressing racial disparities in marijuana charges. That policy only reduced arrests by about 50% and did nothing to address the disparate enforcement of marijuana laws between black and white Virginians. Virginia Public Media recently analyzed court records and found that since decriminalization went into effect, black Virginians are still four times more likely than whites to face a court summons for possession. Proponents say legalizing possession is equitable. It's a huge um, illicit market. Uh, it could be as much as a hundred billion in the United States and what we're looking to do is just create a safe alternative to that. So if cannabis becomes legal this July, Virginia would allow adults to grow up to four plants in their home while businesses like Jushi work with the state to roll out a commercial market over the next three years. Reporting in Northern Virginia, Drew Wilder, News 4.